Hey guys, Linden Squad back for another video, and today we're gonna be building again because it's uh, episode like what nine or ten now. I'm still not sure, but um, yeah, Minecraft Dungeons. I've been playing that quite a bit. Um, so I forgot episode one and two edited. Um, I think I'm gonna have this come out before episode two, so this video is probably out before episode two. So keep that in mind. Um. Now, as you can see, we were working on this last time, but you can see there's a new outline there. And this is because I realized the other day that, um, while looking at it, I realized that the whole volcano bit also had a lake bit next to it, and that the bit that I had built would not have enough space for that. And so I decided instead to basically come back through, make a new shape adding on to it and we'll need to knock out probably a whole wall of that around so we'll get some stone back from that as well so no need to worry about that I played with Alex a bit off camera but we didn't get much work done I don't know whether or not I showed that off in last episode but um oh I showed off the uh, machine I made I think but um I think you guys have seen the machine if you haven't then um I, I can always Oh, I'll, I'll check. You probably haven't seen it, though. But, um, I can check my videos to see if you, I've shown off the machine. But, basically, the machine that I'm talking about is just the building one. And, well, the one in building towers. So, oh boy. Oh boy. I'm gonna go sleep. But, basically, the tower I'm talking... Not the tower. The machine I'm talking about is just the... Uh, machine and building towers so you can go there with the membership uh, I've got one on me yeah you can go there with the membership and get stuff like coal and stuff for extra low prices and of course there's monsters nearby but you know you can get stuff for extra low prices so I think it's worth it oh god okay maybe it'll work this time God damn you! Oh, hey. There we go. Oh, yeah, by the way, I broke that window, so. Um, I'm not gonna fix it either. It's pretty convenient for taking off out of the elytra out of the room. And I could probably f glide back in there. I wouldn't fly back in there. See, the thing is, this is such a big space down in here. And uh, inside the volcano on the Wii Sports Island, there's a little pathway. And there's, there's quite a lot to do when it comes to this volcano part. But th this is like one of the only things I can think of doing. Because I want to get the main structure done before we work on anything else. So I want to go main structure, then mini games and games in general and stuff like that. So, of course, during this project, I'm probably going to need to go in and out of building i'm probably going to need to go back a lot of times and grab stuff but you know time lapses are fun so um i have no clue how long it'll be or what amount of time i'll do the time lapse for but time lapse i guess of me building the the volcano maybe i'm not sure i might just make a cut like this isn't going to look exactly the same and i think i bought that up a couple of times like this side of it, I'm planning on making sure, yes, like, this entire side here of the volcano has to look as, as like, Wii Sports Island as I can get. And I need to put the games and that all around the Wii Sports Island, so, you know. Um, I also need to build, like, a yacht or, like, a big boat on over here, so I don't know how long that's going to take, but I do need to do that and, um, out. But before I just fell there, I was about to say, I've completed it. Now I've got to knock out that whole wall in there. And on top of that, um, if we fly over here, up and over here, you'll see that this looks alright. This is the city area. So around here, there needs to be a couple of little houses and an open field. Over here, there needs to be a lighthouse, so we might build that next instead of moving in. Over on this half here, we need to do like a little oasis looking thing, I guess. And then 
over by the city here we need to have the brawl station which is where it's, it's that game where you have to hit the other person off the platform before they hit you off and I'm thinking of building two facing each other so we can have a spleef one and a brawl one but mainly just a brawl one since that is a game now there's also the um, other stuff like there's table tennis, golf, bowling, esports what is esports? oh that's flying so yeah we might do a flying course around the island which actually you know what yeah we will do a flying course around the island I think that's a pretty good idea is to do a flying course there's lots of different games there's basketball, table tennis, sword play kiteboarding, frisbee, archery yeah so we, we've got some things and it's not like I'm going to be spawning villages over here so we can we, when the um nether update comes out we'll be able to use the target block but for now we'll just use fletchering tables for archery so yeah we'll get into that maybe a bit later on but for now I think we can do some marking out so I'll I'll do all the marking out on camera and knocking out the, this wall on camera because that'll take absolutely forever and I can't be bothered doing that so I will be back really soon alright guys it's been like nearly another hour or two since I spoke to you last um so I've, I've been working I've been working I still haven't done any detail to this big um around about six or seven high wall here so that needs some work being done to it of course the mountain still needs all these edgy bits on here I still need to go and get more stone out I, I ran out a couple of times while working on this bit here um but I've got the base bit here this is where we're going to be building the lake with the small mini castle um in the middle there um and so because of that um we're going to need to dig that out get some sand get some sandstone get that all worked out um which is probably going to take a while but before before I do that I do want to get that mountain bit sorted out so I have to go and grind for some stone and when I've got all that stone I need to place it and then I'll be back this is sort of a project that I'm doing more off camera because of the sheer amount of time it takes to place it and it's just so awkward and also I'm talking to um, Alex as I do this and um, well I mean I'm sure Alex wouldn't mind being in the video it's just he's playing games as well so you know don't want to disturb his game time so yeah I will see you guys all back when I've got the stone to do those little edge bits and after they're done as well so I will see you guys all soon you can see I've got these weird ring things going on but we'll get into that a bit later um there's two of them there's actually four all together on the island but I finished the mountain we can actually walk up over there now so I think we'll do that we can't obviously go inside without using fireworks so we'll get to that a bit later on but for now yeah there's this spot here this needs some grass on it or something got a little lake down here which was actually in the photo as well from that waterfall um, coming over the bridge which was also in the photo and then there's this lake here which doesn't have anything on it on the Wii Sports Island but in the non Wii Sports Island on the Pilot Wing Resort Island which is the exact same island just slightly different it has a castle in there so I'm going to build a little miniature scaled one of that up there is a ring and I'll show you what those rings are if I can get off the ground Oh boy, that was a close one. Um, but basically, it's an elytra flying course. Now, uh, uh, oh, it's really tough. It is so tough. But basically, I want to see if I can do... Oh, that would have surely killed me. Well, maybe not. I'm not sure. Oh boy, okay. Yeah, I'm pretty powerful but yeah it's still not invincible but you know um all in there is all basic uh, it's, it's all basically done like um this here doesn't require too much more like it's basically done I've added the staircases and through that block is the entire inside of it and of course this bit here is actually split off down the bottom because I have to fill that with volcano looking things like like I've got to go to the nether grab all the Actually, you know what? 
I know what I know where I can go to get all the nether items. All I need to do is just fly back over to the shopping district and I'll have all of the nether items in that one nether shulker box inside the new building towers and I have my membership as well so see you guys over there alright guys I am now here in the shopping district again um let me just jump on down here uh, still got all the stuff here um, I'm, I'm not gonna lie um, as I was heading over here it wouldn't let me into the nether and then it said that my world file got corrupted but is able to restore it the world is not corrupted it's fine um also i've got a copy of the world just in case now as well so um but yeah we've got all the stuff in the shopping district as we usually would have if we just come up here again there we go um we're just going to the building tower store which um you know uh do i actually have my diamonds on me because i don't know how much diamonds this is going to cost Oh, okay, extremely glitchy. I do not have diamonds on me. Um, that means that we need to go and... I should really put an ender chest up there, but I know there isn't one. Um, I'll need to get an ender chest and bring myself to have pickaxe with me more often. Okay, but 28 diamonds should be enough, so I'll grab them. Actually, I think I want to check up on a few of my stores. Um, might as well check up while we're here, because all of these are filled with sand and gravel on that, and I don't think anyone's bought any of them. This table's actually broken, I need to fix that. But yeah, no one's bought sand or gravel, which is a shame. Um, I wonder if anyone's bought coal or something. Oh yeah, that's right, yeah, I've already grabbed all the profits from there. And from here, as you can see, I've sold some memberships, I've sold some. That's great. Um, well, just one, but, you know. Oh, it's sunsetting now. Oh, none of the stuff in here is actually selling. I'm selling... Ocean block. I could really move these over, I think. If you didn't know, I've got a head shop. Been end-busting, got some dragon heads. I also have some hidden away elytras, which are just in case someone new joins and they need an elytra, and they don't have the money to buy from my shop yet, so... That and some of them are in the shop as well, so... But yeah, okay. Um, yeah, okay. We've already seen all this, so... Don't want that one. Oh, whoops, right, wrong thing. I bet that that's not it, it's a red one. That's blue. That's green. That's yellow. That's grey, that'll be the mining one. What? No, it can't be out. Oh, all of them are in the back here. Well, I, I do wanna, I do wanna look, make it look like I grabbed it out of the machine. Oh, wow, 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 neither, neither have I ever for two diamonds. Wow, I, I totally didn't not grab that out of the machine. Here we go. Okay. Oh, I never put my membership in. Whoopsie daisies. Oh well, who cares. Um, I've got the Neither Have I Ever box now, which is just filled with stuff <laughs> on the inside of the volcano. I didn't shut that door, that's alright. Don't really need to, it's not mandatory. That one's coming down. And off we go. I've got exactly what I came here for. You know, we could always go to Subway and get some... Actually, you know what? I'm going to have a look around the shopping district. Just in case there's something else I want to buy here. I'll meet you guys back over at the new place. You see, I have to be completely honest with you. And I have to say that I'm happier that this is closer to the base. Rather than that one over there. Which is the Mesa Link. And um, the End City Link as well. Also the shopping district. They're all so far away. Other than this one here. This is the closest one. Like, I, I literally would not need this. I don't need it. I don't know why it's here. It's, it's, it's useless. For all I care, I should basically just make it into a path. I'm not gonna lie, the shopping district link was actually originally made for the jungle, because you've seen my jungle base, I'm pretty sure. And that's why I originally made the sh um, the link, but then we added a shopping district link as well, so...
Ah yes, here I am again. Got the rings. Which um I did say about, didn't I? Pretty sure I did. Oh my god, I was gonna say why did that not die? But I'm pretty sure I mentioned the rings. This place does actually need a bit more lighting up. Well that was useless. Right, there we go. I am not ready to be phantoms at dinner. Or breakfast. I don't well if they only come out at night it would be breakfast for them. It would be dinner for me. But breakfast for them. But yeah, I'm not dying to a phantom. Whoa, I made it through the the ring. But anyway, that's not why we're here. We're here. Oh yeah, by the way, I don't know if I showed it off on camera yet or not. So I'll probably cut this bit out if I have shown it on camera, but here's the lake. But anyway, we're here to go back up through that hole that... Wow, that was loud. Um, but anyway, we're here to go through this hole here and do some work on the inside of the um, the volcano, which doesn't really have an interior yet. So, I mean, this is it at the moment. It's not the worst, but it's not the best either. So I need netherrack and... Soul sand, I'm thinking, and stuff like that for the inside. So, we're going to come around here on the inside of this volcano, break all of these blocks away, and, um, with, with my shovel. And we're going to come in like this, just going to go like this. Or, I'm either just going to do it on one level. I thought probably most likely I'm going to do the netherrack and level off of where I want to put the lava. Okay, so that was not enough netherrack. It was only that strip of it here I can take that name tag and put it somewhere else and same as the box. So there's only one way I really see myself getting any more netherrack and that's to just ha go back to my base where I know there is a ton of netherrack in a chest so I'll meet you guys back over at my base. Alright guys so this here in my hand is just a full box of, oh that's my face, uh, is just a full box of pure netherrack so I am going to sleep over here and then head over, we've got my dogs here, but yeah, it's a full choker box of netherrack, it is a lot of netherrack. Alright, we're back now, uh, I can land up here, I love this outline bit as well, it just, I don't know why, I just think it looks kind of good, so we can just run over the bridge here, back up over there, I don't actually know why I landed, I could have taken off and flown in there. I should be high enough to be able to get into there. There we go. So this is a little bit of work I've already done. This here is just all nether rack. Um, well, it is extremely laggy today. But yeah, all nether rack. So this is all just going to be filled up with nether rack for the time being. Alright guys, I'm back. Uh, I, I finished off the build entirely. The inside's done, the outside's done. It's actually all empty, which I don't know if you guys knew, but it is. And uh, we're not actually going to rock it over here, we're just going to sort of walk over here. We've got to be quick though, because it is turning into night. So, actually, you know what, before it turns completely to night, I'm going to fly over to my house and sleep, because I think that's probably a good idea. Because I, as I've said, don't want to be killed by a phantom, even though I do have a totem of undying, I can still die to a phantom pisses me off. I, I just, I just, I don't like phantoms. A lot of, a lot of people just don't. Oh god. Oh boy. I need to get better at trying to fly through those rings. But anyway, you know, bridge here. There's a little, little tiny bit of a lake down here. So we need to add some trees and a couple of small houses down there. Uh, there's the lake. It looks really good from off the ground. I think I've got, yeah, I've got more rockets. Um, also, right there is where we're going to be building the lighthouse, but you can see what I mean by the lake if we get a bit closer. It's got nice with the contrast and all that. And if we come in here, you'll see... Okay, that damage was a bit delayed. But you can see that this in here is um, the volcano. Um, it's, it's not perfect, but it's not terrible either. It's got some wither roses, which scare me. Um, and of course... For the ring flight 
well for the elytra flight course game you know you'd fly out then i would recommend flying down here and then trying to get through these rings oh oh ah i didn't do it i i've done it multiple times so i know you can do it um i wonder what it would be like to put one like there like that could be cool oh oh that was a terrible idea Oh, uh, anyway, I think I might actually need to go and get some more rockets because I'm down to a stack now. So, we'll do that soon. But anyway, um, I, I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. Uh, leave a like if you did enjoy it. Um, something to do with subscribing. You know what to do. You know what to do. You know. Do the thing. The YouTube thing. I'm pretty sure you guys know what to do. Anyway, I'll see you later. Bye.